This video introduces a more clinically relevant mold that is based on the average dimensions of a mandibular first molar tooth, as are given in Wheeler's Dental Anatomy. Here we can see the dimensions. The mold is 7 mm deep at the proximal box, 11.5 mm wide mesiodistally, and 5 mm deep at the center. The mold is made out of plastic that mimics the light transmission through natural teeth. See how easily the mold folds together? Then composite doesn't stick to the mold. The mold is then clamped together and is now ready to be filled. For this demonstration, we're going to use Filtech Supreme A2B. Here we can see filling the boxes, packing it in. Placing a mylar strip over the top of the composite and now light curing the composite. Once you've finished light curing, the mold opens up easily. The composite doesn't stick to the mold and you can very quickly see how good your light curing technique was, your curing light or your filling technique. In this case, we can see that the composite at the bottom of the proximal boxes does not look fully cured. When we pop the composite out of the mold, we can see this is indeed the case. The composite is soft in the bottom of the proximal boxes. Now we're going to repeat this using Tetric Evo Flow bulk fill composite. We'll inject the composite into the cavity. Note how we don't take the tip out. We'll fill it up completely. We'll put the mylar strip on top and then we'll light cure the composite. When we're finished light curing, we'll remove the mylar strip and open up the mold. As you can see, when we take the composite out of the mold, the composite is hard. And even after placing the composite in a solvent, you can see the solvent has really no effect on the well cured composite. Now, when you place a specimen that was not cured so well into the solvent, you see that the partially and the uncured composite is dissolved away. This is especially noticeable at the bottom of the proximal box. This is where most of the failures occur, at the bottom of the proximal box. This easy to use MOD mold is now available from Ultradent. It shows you how well your curing light cures your composites. And it also shows you how good your filling technique is. If you're interested in finding more about this mold, please contact Ultradent. As always, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. Thank you very much for listening.